Hi everybody and welcome into my channel. Thank you so much for tuning in to this video today. Today's video is going to be about the goose spare animal and what it means when you see this animal inside of your life. Now I'm going to be going into the symbolism behind this animal, the goose, and also the overall meaning behind this animal and what it means when it's actually coming through to your life as an omen, an animal totem, or just as some type of messenger, okay? So without further ado, let's go ahead and see what we can learn about the goose spirit animal. Okay guys, um, I don't know if you noticed it, but can you hear me? Can you, can you, can you hear me? <laughs> That's right, we are getting professional. So you know what I'm saying, I hope you guys can hear me. I know you can hear me because I got this nice little swifty little professional touch to my channel now where you guys got the high quality sound quality. But anyways, today's video is gonna be about the goose spirit animal. So what are the first things we can talk about when we talk about the goose, okay? First thing about the goose is understanding that these animals inside of nature are very family orientated. This animal is all about love, it's all about community, and it's all about having compassion. But it's not just about having love and compassion, but it's really about having devotion, okay? So when you see a goose inside of your life, it could be telling you that it is now time for you to actually be devoted to your loved ones, to care for them, to nourish them, to really just be there for them because they may need you or because you may benefit them in some kind of way. They just need your love. Whether you're seeing one goose and it's by itself or whether you're seeing two goose or whether you're seeing uh, two geese or whether you're seeing a flock of geese, okay? It still comes through as a representation of love. So when it comes to understanding the synchronicities of animal totems and spirit animals, when you see them inside of your life, some of the things that can actually help you is understanding what was occurring when you saw this totem, when you saw this animal. So for example, if you just see one goose, it could be actually referring to you giving love back to yourself. It could be telling you that now's the time to give yourself some self-love. Now's the time to nourish yourself. Now's the time to look after yourself. Say loving words to yourself. Um, do loving activities to yourself. Doing activities that make you feel like you care about you, okay? That way you can actually fill your cup up. If you're seeing two geese flying and they look like they're in a great partnership and they look like they are enjoying life through the sunset or the morning rise, sunrise, it's coming through to tell you that you are potentially going to meet a partner soon or that you should be paying attention to the relationship that you have with a friend or the relationship that you have with a romantic partner to make sure that you're putting more love into you guys's relationship equally okay not just giving just love to them but giving love to the actual relationship doing things that are going to help the relationship and the union okay because geese are really about unionship and just being in union and being in um being in alignment with community and being in alignment with somebody else okay and if you're seeing a flock of geese then what the geese are doing when you see the flock of geese is they're actually migrating and traveling from place to place and you may notice that when geese fly within flocks it happens a lot it happens a lot when you see geese with a bunch of other geese whether they're flying in the sky or whether they're on the ground walking on a field there's like a trillion of them and it's like where did they come from and the reason why there's so many of them is because geese are a little different from other birds. There's some birds that do this as well, but when it comes to geese, they actually really hold on to their family members and their loved ones and their friends. So if they give birth and their child gets older and their child can fly and goes on its own, the ch that adult 
geese will actually go back and visit the parents. It's not like they stray away from the parents. The family, the community, the sense of love and the sense of union really stays when it comes to geese. And that's what it's telling you when you see a big group of geese inside of your life. Whether you have only one friend, two friends, or whether you don't have that much of a big community, it's okay. It could be referring to your angelic community. It could be referring to your spirit guides, your angel guides, your ancestors, those that you can't see with your physical eyes. Some of you can see them with your physical eyes, but those that are inside of a different realm than this physical realm, okay? So the overall message for geese is coming through to tell you to be really committed it's about having commitment with whatever it is that you're doing, with whoever it is that you're dealing with, to make sure that you are filling up some type of cup, whether it's your own cup, whether it's a partner's cup, whether it's you guys' cup as a union, or whether it's the cup of your family. So make sure that you guys are keeping the love up, keeping your vibrations up, keeping your frequency up, and also opening your heart to experiencing love because that's all about the goose and when it comes to understanding it even further if you guys are having trouble in your life or if you're having trouble with um, you know basically feeling like you may be on the wrong path or that you need some guidance you guys check out the link inside the description box below because I do do intuitive readings I do intuitive readings and you guys can easily schedule it through my website which is inside the description box below as well make sure that you like this video if you're liking it make sure that you guys subscribe comment share the video and it is always appreciated all right so once again thank you so much for tuning into this video Keep the love up, keep your cup full, and make sure that you guys also pour that cup towards others once it gets filled. So thank you so much, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye-bye. <laughs>